Hello guys and welcome back on Dapp World. Until now we have installed the Phantom Wallet and initiated React application. Now let's try to connect with the wallet. Open app.js file and in the app function add the event listener for the window load. So when window is loaded completely, we can check for the wallet if it's installed by the user or not. Now let's write the code to detect the wallet. Inside the function, let's check if the wallet is available or not with this piece of code. If window.solana is available, then we have found the wallet. Otherwise, let's alert the user with message. Let's create one state to save the fetched wallet address. Remember to import the youth state hook from the react at the first time. Now in the if window.solana condition, let's request the wallet for connection and get the address. Do note that we will get the address of account only if the wallet is connected with the application. Let's try to fetch the connected user's account address here. The parameter only trusted will make sure the wallet is connected with the application previously and it completely trusts the application. If the user is visiting the application for first time and his a wallet is not yet connected with the application, then we will render the connect button. These lines of code defines that if wallet address is not defined or null, then render the next div. Here we have used the class name btn which is defined in the app.css file. The complete app.css file will be provided later. You can directly copy and paste the file contents. For now let's define the connect wallet function which will be invoked when user clicks on the button. Now below not wallet address condition add these lines. Here we define that if wallet address is present then render the following div. Now let's start the react server with npm run start. If you have not connected the wallet already to the application then you should see the connect button otherwise the address. Click on the connect button and the phantom wallet pop up will come asking for the permission to connect the wallet with application. Approve and connect the wallet with application. As soon as you connect, you will see the connected address on the application page. So that's it for this tutorial. In the next tutorial, we will define functions to call and update the value on the Solana program. See you in the next tutorial.